choosing people praise the lord hallelujah the hope of our lord jesus christ praise the lord hallelujah my name is Ike Chuku Onoaha. I am here in your midst to testify the goodness of God upon my life. Um, my first testimony is uh, I used to hear of choosing, choosing, choosing. Uh, because I'm a, I am seen, seen of believing. So I'm a commercial bus driver. So one day, I was driving along National Stadium. I was going to Lagos Island with passengers in my, in my vehicle. So I saw choosing people, many of them with apron. They were doing evangelism. They were passing. They were sharing handbeats. So I happened to be the one I stopped for them to cross. So as they were crossing in my front, one sister approached me and gave me handbeats. He threw it inside my vehicle. Then I put it on top of my dashboard. So I, was, I continued working. The, the, the handbeat was here on top of my dashboard. So in the evening, you know, we normally go back to Lagos Island to pick passengers that come back to Sulere. So in the evening, I was going back empty. So immediately I climbed Alaka Bridge, going to Lagos Island. A fire now burst out in my vehicle, uh, in front of my vehicle. Boom! Heavy fire. So as I was struggling with the fire, my, first tire, my front tire now hit the covert. The covert of a top bridge, that a uh, co bridge. My vehicle was tumbling, 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 tumbling. So when the vehicle tumbled, how many times I can't remember. So I, I got myself. Then I, when I rushed out from the vehicle, the whole four tires was up. So the vehicle that were following me, they all stopped. So they came out. I was I was shaking. So one rich man now approached me. He now asked me, "Am I am I the driver of this vehicle?" I say yes. He now asked me, which church am I going? Because I know they go church. I know they go church. You know, we downfall drivers. We know, they, we know they go church. But the one thing I thank God is that uh, that's why I'm a downfall driver. I don't smoke. I don't drink. I don't humanize. So, and I, and I look inside my vehicle and I see that hand beat where that sister give me. I say, I'm a choosing. Say that again. Can you repeat what you said? That hand be that that is I throw inside my vehicle. When the vehicle tumbled, when that, that man asked me which church did they go, and I look inside the vehicle, I saw the hand beat. It was written sorrow to joy. So I told him, choose him. Hey! So he said, Go and thank your God, your God is alive. Hey! So that is how praise the Lord. Clap on to God of the chosen mystery, miracle working God. When did this incident take place? When? When did this? It happened if, from, if you are from National Stadium, you are going to Lagos Island. When? When? Which date? Which month? It happened in year 2020. Okay, 2020. Yes, sir. So, I started coming to choosing. I become, because that man told me to go and thank my God that my God is alive. So, I started coming. So, my God begin to transform my life I became the member of choosing hmm. taking the world by signs and wonders so to God. as I was coming to choosing my, my little daughter she was 4 years old and his brother is 6 years old so they were playing so I don't know how manage the, the pieces uh, clothes button button of their clothes so the piece is now, a brother now push it into her ear. So the little girl, my daughter was trying to bring it out because anytime I want to remove something on my ear, she normally watch me. I normally use broom. So she was trying to do what I normally do to bring that button out. She was pushing it into her ear. She was pushing it to her ear. To the extent the pieces of that button go to her brain. Hey! So the only solution to bring that button out is oppression. And you know what that will cost to open her ear? her head and I'll bring it out and there is no money over three weeks she cannot eat she cannot sleep I was restless so on that Thursday morning one spirit now tell me why not go to Thursday deliverance service and I hacking to that voice I came so I was sitting somewhere here to my surprise 
Daddy Gio, God will bless you. <laughs> so, to my surprise, Daddy Gio, general overseer of this great ministry, now mentioned the case. Hey. Exactly as it happened. Hey. I was surprised because I didn't hear of choosing miracle me at that time until I see. He said, if you are the one, raise your hand up. And I raise my right hand up. And I pray. He said, when you get home, if you are the one, place this hand on that ear. And call the God of choosing three times. Hey! Hey, hey, hey! I said, hey, hey, hey! Let's know what happened. Let us hear the complete picture. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. The people of God, glory be to God. Hallelujah. The chosen hey. generation, glory be to Almighty God. Hallelujah. When I got home, my wife was looking at me. Didn't come with me, oh. and I placed my hand on that ear as choosing as my pastor said. Now, I carried my daughter on my lap. I placed that hand on that ear. I bent her, and I say, "Oh God, if you are, if you are true God in this ministry, let answer your name in this little girl." I say, "God of choosing." The God of choosing and the God of choosing. The guy shook and that thing came out immediately. Hey! Hey! hey, hey. Yes, the God of signs and wonder. The God of signs and wonder. God of choosing God. The signs and wonders. He has done what no man can do. God of chosen. Is the God of signs and wonders. God of chosen God. The signs and wonders. He has done what no man can do. God of chosen. The God of signs and wonders. The God of signs and wonders. God of choosing God of signs and wonders. He has no Give him another standing ovation. Clap unto him. Mighty God. The God of the chosen. God of the pastor of the chosen. The covenant keeping God. Thank you, Father. We greet you and we salute you. Thank you for magnifying your servant. Magnifying this ministry. Thank you, Father. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. If you are there now listening to me, if you don't believe that God can do it, God is able to do even more than that for hey. you. Hey. Our hey. God is alive. He's a good God. So when that thing came out with uh, uh, something like uh, uh, Qatar have filled it in over three weeks, and now clean everything. The food she demanded for food, we gave her food. Immediately she slept off. She slept from that five o'clock in the evening, that Thursday till six in the morning the next oh. day. So that is how God delivered my daughter from that oppression. Hey. God canceled that oppression. Help me and thank God. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So, from there I begin. I started coming to choosing. I started coming. So my neighbor. In fact, as I'm here standing in your presence now, I'm a, I'm a living testimony. Hmm. Uh, let, let me tell you. Uh -huh, I will tell you. Uh -huh. Because it be like, last, uh, last combined, one sister gave testimony, said, God love him. Say, be like, say, I'm God love. Now lie, now me God love pass. The love of God upon my life is greater than your own. Uh -huh. Make you listen now, you go hear him. So, my neighbor, because of envy, because of the wickedness of people of this world, because of their bad mind, because of their envy, my neighbor that I'm living together in the compound, you know, no, that's, you know, no, say I don't become choosing another power, don't they? So, he just made a sudden travel. He's from Delta State. He's from uh, um, um, he's from Delta State. From Isoloku. So he now he now travel now. <clears throat> sudden travel like that with his vehicle. He too is a commercial bus driver. He owns a Toyota bus. 
So I now asked his wife, uh, this one where your wife does, your husband does travel. I said, no, no. No knowing that this man went to village to do charm for me to keep me from motor accidents. <laughs> he traveled, he came back on Friday. So that charm was inside his vehicle. He's waiting on Sunday night to do what the native doctor said make he do. So that he to go there, there for work, he go hear the news. So on Sunday, he was inside his vehicle because he normally go at early morning around 5. He applied to Ijesha Road. He carried passenger from Ijesha to CMS. Me, I applied to do motor. But he normally go at early, early morning for club. So that Sunday, Sunday night, I came out. He was still inside his vehicle around 9 because around 7 I have already slept up because of he wake up early. So I was wondering, say, ah, I don't carry anything for mind. So I own my jail because we don't have light. I own my big jail. I slept off. So I ran, I was sleeping, deep sleeping. I see somebody was waking me, waking me, beating me. Because then my people they are they have traveled to village. By then I was alone. Somebody was beating me, beating me very well to wake up. And I woke up. When I woke up, the hand, the person was beating me, I'm feeling the pain. And I look around, who is beating, who woke me up and beat me like this? Beat me very well to wake up. As I was looking around, doubting who beat me. And I had a voice. Why can't you go outside and check your boss whether you lock and wear? Ah, ah. And I check, I, I look around. I'm not, I'm not living with anybody. The voice now repeat again. I say, go outside, go check your vehicle, whether the vehicle is well locked. Ah, ah. I came out for parlor. I own my light. Okay, I now obey that voice. I took my one techno phone, they have touch light on his head. And I went outside. So when I approached my vehicle, that my boss, you know, uh, it's my driver door that I want to first check. Immediately I approached the door to check it. The door is locked, but I perceive an order. One can't bad order. And I begin to ask, eh, what did they smell like this? I'll be passing call you near my motor. So I check the doors. I won't go inside because the doors are locked according to the voice. I won't enter our compound. The voice now repeat again with broken. You know, I'll go check, you know, I'll go check as the piece for your tire, make you use water flush them. And I shake. I don't see who they talk to me. Okay, I'm not on that touch light. Immediately I go to that my driver tire for front. Because now they are perceived the other. And I bend down. As I point the touch light, and I see something like oil where they split for the tire. I, I was looking at it because oil when it's dripping is different from water. I was wondering, I said, what is this? That night. It was more to eleven in the night. I look at it, I look at it. I said, now wow. Because my mind no carry that thing when I see. See the prayer, see the thing where keep me alive today. See the thing when I thought where keep me alive today. I say, Almighty God, any evil arrow against me, I command you back to sender in the name of Jesus. The God of Jesus. I pray that any evil arrow against me, I command you back to sender. And I saw I do hand. I say, Holy Ghost fire. And I stood up. As I stand up, I see one huge man. Very huge man, you know, wear clothes. You see, him was a tall like this building. He was looking at me like immediately into our compound. Shut up. All this cold there, this in full my body. And I look inside our compound. I say, ah, this is why they see spirit by this time. I say, anything where person know, make you know I'm going go inside and sleep. No, no, that immediately have do that charm. That my neighbor have do that charm. That demon is there. Spirit of death is waiting for me to take my vehicle the next morning. Go and finish me. So that. That time I said back to send that he went back to him. He slept with him till the next morning where he took his own bus. So me, I was preparing to come for work. Immediately I was driving out. People now rush. I say, wait, wait, wait. I can wait. I can wait. I say what? They say motor don't kill one day, motor don't kill one day now. Motor don't kill one day now. Ah. I say which one day? They say your neighbor now. For Paco or Toba there, and I didn't motor kill him. Ah. So we now. I was surprised because all of us we are together on Sunday morning now. We now took his dead body. We oh. took him to Ojole Barando General Hospital. So he was lying down dead. I no carry anything for mine. So we were surprised. We now took his dead body around 12 to Itire Police Station to take a police report. They want to carry him back to Delta to put for mortuary. So they carried him. And we were I was crying. You know, my neighbor. No one knows saying at me for like that, like that. So the next morning being Tuesday, that is when I decided to go to work. So as I was driving from that, getting to that place, he died at Pako Road. 
hold up now, hold up. A madman just appeared to me for my door. He said, brother, I was there when Moto Killer last week. Oh. Die your neighbor when Moto Kill here. I am the eyewitness, I witness as he take die. Now you, you won't kill where you go kill yourself. Oh. And now seven people die for them at the same time. And the seven people will die for them at the same time. And I'm going to kill all of them. I'm going to kill one for Shodi. I'm going to kill one for Mushi. He mentioned the seven places where I'm going to kill seven people that die follow him at the same time. Hey! He said, go and, hold, go and serve your God and serve only your God. Your God is with you. He disappeared. Hey! Yeah. Hey! So, hey! Hey! Praise the Lord. I was, Hallelujah! I was surprised. I said, then I begin the record. Uh -uh. Does it mean that one day I'm me one key? I begin the record according to what the madman tell me. So uh -uh. I say, Shane, I mean conky. I can't remember the thing when I see for Sunday night, yesterday night, uh, Sunday night. I know if you go work that day, I was surprised. So three boys volunteered to carry in dead body from our streets. They said they would go and find out that, 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 that person kill him. Say he die hard, no be God time. So when they came back on Wednesday, which is very good, then call me. They say, I can come. Say, go and thank your God. Now you, one day, one kilo. Hey. Say, when they go ask native doctor for death, I did. native doctor tell them, say, when he call my name, he mention my name, they tell him, make him leave me. That the power that is with me is great. He say, no grief. Hey. 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 Power. Be a chosen. I'm being dominion, authority, and power. So when they tell him, make him leave me. Now the native doctor, they tell these three boys from our streets, say, no grief, say, he don't kill many people for post up. Say, if you just offend, I mean, go don't waste you. I'm very innocent, handsome looking man. But he's a poison, he's a, say, if you say he succeed, the next person waiting for kill and wife. Say, go and thank your God. Say, sure, I see, he gave everything I see on Sunday night, I said them, yes. I, I was now begin to, I, I begin to praise God. So, the next week, Monday, being the week when he died, I didn't want bury him. No, no, that they broke his spirit out. You know, data people, I am sorry, data people, they're too strong for Juju. They broke his spirit out and give him cutlass for, to come for revenge for me. So when I closed work that Monday evening, as I opened my door, I saw smoke, but in shape of a woman being with cutlass. And I released the fire of the Lord. Oh, Holy Ghost, fire. As I released that fire, I hear inside a room, guru, 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 they, everywhere scattered. So, my brothers and sisters here, that is how God Almighty, this God we serve, delivered me. Hey! That is how God visited me in the hey! night. In the morning, he saved my life from power of grave. God saved me from power of death. The, the, the pit my enemy dug for me, my enemy fell into it. Hey! Glory be to God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise God of choosing. Praise him, he's a good God indeed. That is how God delivered me from death. Hey. That is how God delivered me from power of grave. Glory be to his holy name Amen. forever and ever. Now I want to pray for my daddy in Jew and the member of this great ministry worldwide. I pray that my God will uphold you people. I pray for heaven at last for everyone in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray for daddy Jew. A mommy, heaven at last, in the name of Jesus. Amen. That after our toiling and this heavenly race on earth, we will make it at last in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you all and help me and thank God I'm a living testimony for in Jesus' name. Chosen you are may we be forever and ever more. Chosen I will be forever and ever more. Chosen I will be forever and ever. Amen. Hold on a moment. Gio is in the pulpit. Hold on. Amen. Praise the Lord. Choosing people, you have something. Amen. Praise the Lord. Now, let me take you on this point. The
sisters that were making noise and doing publicity that threw in the handbill does not know what the handbill has cost. He doesn't know the effect of the handbill he threw into the bus. That through that handbill today, this young man has been spared. His life has been spared. He is saved, the families are saved, and today he is giving testimony. But that person that gave the handbill doesn't know. Praise the Lord. Therefore, I want to plead with you. Go and make noise. Go and make noise. Go and spread the good news. Go and spread the handbill. Go and invite everybody. Because this is the time of great explosion. I rest and God is hungry to do something wondrous before the trumpet sound. Go and do what? Make noise because this is a place of reality. There is no fake. This is a place of reality. Go out and make great noise and move everybody to come. Don't worry. You may not know the impact of what you are doing is uh, making, uh, but this is an example that it was not an empty word. It was not an empty noise. Neither was the hand be wasted. Was he wasted? So go out, uh, throw hand be, give them. You will not know what you have done, but they lose a miracle and revival. Who control to spread? Go and make noise. Go and share the hand. Remember, don't forget this regional crusade, which will be taking place in on Saturday. I mean, on Friday, Friday evening. Am I right? In all our region, everybody here, wherever the region you belong to, make sure you join them and do publicity and bring people to the regional crusade. God is about to do something. And I want to let you know, some of the people that are sitting down here as newcomers today join you from the regional crusade. Uh, uh, am I right? Please, are there people that join us from regional crusade? The newcomers, can I see their hands up?